we should stop caring about what other people think when we get dressed. For future Parisian aesthetic videos, it's wearing what you want to wear, but at the same time, remaining classy and following the rule, less is more. <laughs>
many prints out there. I think we should just have fun with it. There's stripes, there's polka dots, there's floral, there's leopard print, there's cow print, there's zebra print, there's plaid, there's so much more. Like the, the list goes on of how many different patterns there are. You can even mix the patterns. I love mixing prints and patterns. You can even wear a plaid suit or like a floral suit. You can have fun with it. And if you are afraid of print, again, handbags, shoes, a scarf, even like a blazer, a plaid blazer, that's some print, get some print. And speaking of blazers, it's also good to invest in a lot of blazers. Invest in different kinds of blazers too. Uh, navy blue, black, gray, brown, plaid, different patterns of plaid, different shapes and forms. There are so many different types of blazers out there. I love going to the thrift store and looking in the men's section and just cutting out the shoulder pads and I feel like I have a really good loose fitted blazer. That did not make sense, loose fitted blazer. Loose blazer that you can make fitted like with a belt. I've been seeing that a lot lately too, just taking belts. The next tip is to layer in the cold and wrap in the warm. So what I mean by that is going back to the trench coat thing, you can wear a blazer, a fitted blazer, a trench coat and a coat to keep yourself warm if you're really cold or like a trench coat and a coat, blazer, coat, whatever you want. Then in the spring and summer, when it starts to get warmer, do wrap dresses, wrap skirts, wrap tops. Think very rouge of this. Invest in some sort of wrap thing, whatever you want. For the next little bit, I'm basically going to give you a little chat and what I think the Parisian style and aesthetic means. Trends come and go. They do. Classy, classic style will always remain. Look at Audrey Hepburn. You can play with trends if you'd like. I'm not saying don't go after the trends, but the Parisian aesthetic, they I feel like they play with more of the trends on a color and pattern side of things, not so much like the Y2K. Like I have not seen a lot of people in France doing Y2K style. Also, I think the Parisian aesthetic is to exude confidence and that's really what it is it's having confidence to wear whatever the fuck you want i'm giving you permission it's 2021 we should stop caring about what other people think when we get dressed you know if you want to wear something crazy if you want to wear something more comforting to you do it who cares like it's your body it's your mind and it's just having confidence to wear whatever you want and I think that's what it is they have like you just have to walk with confidence and I feel like I could go on and on about confidence and gaining confidence and it does it's a roller coaster it goes up and down all the time and that's fine that's life but I will probably do another video in the future about confidence because it's something that I'm very passionate about for future Parisian aesthetic videos it's wearing what you want to wear, but at the same time, remaining classy and following the rule, less is more. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like this, please give it a thumbs up. I will be doing a Parisian style aesthetic lookbook. I gotta figure out the outfits too, because like I said, I got like 10 aesthetics in my closet, so it's kind of harder for me to make certain lookbooks on certain aesthetics. Thank you again for Anna Luisa for sponsoring this video and be sure to check out their websites. I will have every item linked down below so you guys can go ahead and check them out. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video. Be sure to follow me on Instagram and I will leave all the influencers and content creators of the pictures that I shared linked down below so you guys can follow them and get inspired as well. But thank you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!